Hey guys, was inspired by a user on TikTok to try my hand at a lionfish. Figured, why not? Always game for creating fun creatures. So if you want to see the process, you know what to do. First, glue down those eyebrows. Apply a latex bald cap with Prose adhesive. Stipple some latex on the edges to blend. Start with Skin Illustrator Taxi for the markings. Wanted this to be as bright as possible, so I didn't want to layer it onto the red. Next, use Skin Illustrator Concentrate and Prime Red. Use this as opposed to the regular liquid because it builds up much faster. Applying it with a brush, then took an airbrush to smooth it out some. Took Mehron Paradise Paint in red and add some contouring with the airbrush. Grab Skin Illustrator Liquid Color Capillary to intensify the shading and add some blotchy texture on the head and body. Took Skin Illustrator Complexion Palette and took the capillary color and spattered it in the red regions. Followed by Skin Illustrator Black. Went back to the taxi color and cleaned up the outer edges of the markings, still making them ragged and not too smooth. Use Phoenix out of the Skin Illustrator Nova 6 palette to add in some highlights. With Skin Illustrator White Liquid, create some small noodling patterns on the chin, brow area, and on the chest. Also put some lightly along the nose. Take some more of the white skin illustrator and spatter it on those areas and across the nose. And then grabbed a brush and added some larger freckling. Put some Anastasia Beverly Hills eye primer around the eyes and blended it out. Use the Collective Cosmetics Inferno color from the Fire and Brimstone collection on the outer parts of the eyes. With shade in from the Collective Cosmetics Darken the outer corner of the eye. Then using the Collective Cosmetics Morning Star from the same collection over the rest of the lid. Take the shade and color again and blend into Morning Star and add it under the eye. With the Collective Cosmetics Morning Star, bump up the high points. Another color from the Fire and Brimstone collection, Fallen, darken the outer edges of the eye and deepen some of the shadow areas. Put Suva Beauty Hydra FX Liner in Dance Party to line the yellow markings. Then back with the Skin Illustrator Taxi Color to build up the opacity. Taking Skin Illustrator Black Liquid, airbrush large blotching on the shoulders and around the back portion of the head. Next, Skin Illustrator Mardi Gras Palette, take Cajun Red and spatter over the makeup. Now for a quick run through on how the fins were made. Took spines made out of foam clay and hot glued them on some sheer fabric. Then trimmed them into shape and hot glued the pieces to fabric netting so they could stand up when glued down. Start with Skin Illustrator Gesture Yellow, then some of the Suva Beauty Dance Party to create a brighter yellow. Use the Cajun Red and added markings to the fins and spines. And added some striping to the fins with Skin Illustrator Black. Glued down the head spines with Prosade and carefully pressed the netting into place. Put some of the taxi color over the netting to blend it in. Now with Skin Illustrator Copper Color, airbrush over everything for added sparkle. Back in with the Skin Illustrator Phoenix Color to brighten the high points and add dimension on the top of the head. Also to color in the lips. Add some stark highlights with some of the white Skin Illustrator and spatter more of the white. Back to the Mayron palette, this time with Beach Berry, and spatter over the red. Then glued on the head fins and applied Taxi in the inner of the lips. Put some of the Collective Cosmetics shade and color in the outer parts of the lips and extended the corners of the mouth with NYX Cosmetics, that's the point eyeliner, and add some Taxi where the extensions are. 
airbrush some prime red to the base of the fins to blend them into the rest of the makeup. Took the Collected Cosmetics eyeshadow shade Abyss and deepen where needed. Once the scleras were in, use KVD Vegan Beauty Lash Liner on the waterline. With the Collective Cosmetics Moon Twin Palette Highlighter in Sundial, add some pop to those highlight points and also on the eyelid. Glue the last fins onto the collarbones and airbrush the prime red to tie it in. And there you go. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time.